Mein Name ist Martin Bauer. My name is Martin Bauer. I'm 52 years old and have been chief physician at the clinic for anesthesiology, surgical intensive care medicine and pain therapy of the St. Vincent's Hospital Group Paderborn for eight years. The St. Joseph's Hospital is a primary care hospital. It serves the city of Salzkotten and the western district of Paderborn. We run three surgical departments in our hospital. There is the clinic for orthopedics and trauma surgery, then the clinic for general and abdominal surgery, and finally, the clinic for gynecology and obstetrics. Here in the St. Joseph's Hospital, we traditionally mainly perform intravenous anesthesia by administering propofol and remifentanil. This has proven itself over many years to be a good combination and ensures safe and reliable wake-up times. The intravenous, an intravenous anesthesia, and especially remifentanil, suppresses spontaneous breathing reliably and safely. For this reason, we need a safe and reliable controlled ventilation pattern. And for this purpose, the Zeus is ideally qualified, offering different types of ventilation which we can set according to the clinical needs. In terms of performance, the Zeus is equivalent to an intensive care ventilator. We have been using the ventilation regime Smart Ventilation Control, abbreviated to SVC, for some years. This semi-automatic ventilation mode allows on the one hand lung protective ventilation and on the other hand ensures the end tidal CO2 values are kept within the target range. As an anesthesiologist, you have to perform a great many diverse tasks. It can hence quickly happen that you lose track of the end tidal CO2. SVC helps to keep this value constant. Thus, it reduces the likelihood of hypocapnia, which is known to lead to reduced cerebral blood flow and is not good for the patient. I am the person responsible for training on all our medical devices. Consequently, I am trying to train all employees comprehensively so they can safely use the new functions. This is very easy for smart ventilation control. The graphical user interface is structured very clearly and you can easily follow the individual steps of the algorithm via the graphical and numerical displays. Therefore, after a detailed briefing, my colleagues have hardly any concerns in how to use it. For me, smart ventilation control is part of my routine program. I always turn on SVC first as it decreases my workload and frees my mind for other tasks. SVC allows me to look after the ventilation at a later stage. Smart ventilation control is a real added value for anesthesia. If activated, it maintains the target ranges of ETCO2 and tidal volume throughout the entire course of anesthesia. These target ranges are safely maintained even if the patient's position is changed during the surgical procedure or if any pressure conditions change. The intelligent, well-structured algorithm always follows the clinical targets and the patient is therefore ideally ventilated. With all our experiences of the last months and years, we are convinced that this semi-automatic ventilation mode is significantly increasing the safety of our patients.